most people practicing manifestation is purely just practicing from this physical reality. They're mm-hmm. not thinking about other dimension. But what you uh, quite rightly said was that because we're existing and time is not linear, time is not real, we're existing in future and in past at the same time in multiple dimensions. Therefore, if we were able to, through deep meditation, move out into future or even to change past or to change something in outer layers of dimension, then... Namaste creators and welcome, welcome in another episode, Ask Master Anything. I'm Paulina and today I'm of course with Master Sri Akashana. Namo Himalaya Master. Namo Himalaya. First of all, I would like to say massive thank you for always being here, dedicated your busy schedule and finding the time to answer the questions of our creators. So today's questions, I am so curious to listen to that answer. My question is, and the question comes from Roland. I saw myself in a dream driving my dream car. Does that mean it's in my subconscious mind and it will manifest in time? (laughs) (laughs) Uh, That's a wonderful question. Um, So first of all, to identify that dream is not uh, dream is not dream. Dream is a is a dimension that we exist in. When we switch off from this reality, we switch in and we awaken in a different reality. And so if you've seen yourself driving your dream car already, that represents that that manifestation is already done. Does that mean that it will definitely show up in this physical reality? Not necessarily. Mm. Why? Because we are multidimensional beings. So we are existing in multiple dimensions at the same time. In future dimension, one dimension, that car is existence with them. They are driving it, their car. So that manifestation exists, which is a good thing because for some people it doesn't exist. When we know it exists like that, then now all Roland needs to do is align, keep aligning, working hard, align thoughts, align feelings, align action, align openness to receiving, align everything towards that goal. And for sure, it's going to show up. Why do we know that? Because it's already done. If you can see it in dream, we know that it's already in existence in different dimension. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Thank you, Master. So I've got a question, actually. Um, How often do we need to practicing in this dimension to bring three things from the other dimension into that reality? I think that um, this, is a, this is a question from a very conscious standpoint, a high level of consciousness, because most people practicing manifestation is purely just practicing from this physical reality. They're not thinking about other dimension. But what you uh, quite rightly said was that because we're existing and time is not linear, time is not real, we're existing in future and in past at the same time in multiple dimensions. Therefore, If we were able to, through deep meditation, move out into future or even to change past or to change something in outer layers of dimension, then um, then we can uh, amplify the results that's happening in this reality. You say, how often should you do that? Um, If you have the conscious and the right practices, for example, third eye meditation practices that uh, we usually uh, share with the creators as well. Um, I would say probably just once a month or something like that is already enough because actually we have to reside in this dimension. This is where we're living for this limited amount of time. We can't just be like this all day long every day. So I would say once a month is, 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 is good. We do that during every satsang every month as well. Um, so people are all free to join that. And, um, if they want to be a little bit more intense with it, with their own practices, maybe once a week, they can go into a deep dimension and then make some adjustments in outer layers as well. So other than that, I think that people should, uh, should focus on in this physical dimension, how to align the energies. Beautiful. Thank you so much, master. So Roland, now you know what to do. And I believe so many of you creators, you got your answers. Also, if you will 
search in master channel you can find so many different meditations different um, techniques to manifesting into your reality and um, so that's what i wish to everyone and also if you guys haven't downloaded our app um, creator circle please do why because you can have opportunity to ask master anything and um, find me and um, i will guide you through that journey to be featured on our ama show and um, what i would like to say thank you one more time um, like comment and of course subscribe to stay tuned with us thank you so much master namo himalaya namo himalaya